on everyone welcome to Six Flags Magic Mountain and I just got off of my first ever ride here on West Coast Racers the new for 2020 roller coaster premier ride multi-launch coaster Drew hey oh hey you oh my gosh Whoa, wow. in the middle of vlog uh, you weren't on that ride but uh, this is your home park yes I feel like I should ask you what you think but it doesn't really matter because you've been this plenty of times here's what I think so <laughs> Wow! <laughs> I don't know why I did that. Wow, it's windy all of a sudden. Yeah. Okay, so, this thing is really fun. <laughs> well, guys, we're like not even a minute into this video and it's already falling apart. Alright, so, um, this thing's really fun. Um, Zach and I just got off of, that was at least my second ride, and what we were both saying as we got off was, it is just fun to just watch the other train the, the entire time. time. Just track it, and now, in the two rides I've gotten, I've known someone on the other train, or at least one of the other trains going on, yeah. and that is by far the best way to experience this ride, is when you know someone, and then that way you're just like reaching your arms out, trying to touch them, uh, like, you know, trying to high five, like, that high five, by the way, is totally awesome, that yeah, is the best part of the ride. So I have not actually left this area yet, uh, I came straight over here and wanted to ride, and then I was doing some filming. But uh, yeah, for that reason, uh, I haven't written anything else today, but we've just been hanging out. Um, I did get to a chance to walk around at least the underground section of Magic Mountain because that is this brand new area. So uh, for instance, over here is the speed shop. They got lots of uh, different like graffiti or, or graphic designs and everything is themed to like roads, you'll find parking spaces everywhere. It's just a very nice looking area. Actually, it's a lot better looking in person than I personally was expecting. Here's a good graphic design. Sun is not working our favor here, but there you go. You can see it. So yeah, West Coast Racers, as much as it is a meme, I actually did really enjoy it. And again, I'm going to have a full review coming soon, but I'll just show you guys around just a little bit, give you an idea of what is uh, this sign right here for West Coast Racers. That is new as of like two days ago or something like that. We're here on a weekend at the end of January. As you can see, uh, the line is not that long. It's all indoors, so. Uh, which earlier today was spilling out just a little bit, but they've done a pretty good job at putting those crews through. Actually, my second ride, when we were in that waiting area, we barely waited at all. I mean, we were pretty much just, we took a stop real quick and then dispatched, and then we were on our way to do our second race, so. Um, I would say the pit stop is maybe a little underwhelming, but you know, when the crews are being fast and then you don't actually wait very long there, it's a lot better. Um, quick taco review. I ate at that place. I had this weird thing. It was like kind of a taco. I don't know. I don't even remember what it was called. It was like a pomp or something. Um, it was pretty good food. I liked it because it was something very different from what you can find in the rest of the park. This here is Pit Stop, the best restrooms in the entire park. And of course over here, Apocalypse. You know it, you love it, maybe. I love it. And uh, I mean, that's pretty much it. This area was Cyclone Bay, and holy crap guys, this is so much better than that. So yeah, it, I, I definitely give full approval of this area. West Coast Racers really kind of changed the entire feel of this park. And um, what's been fun is I'm here with uh, some other guys who are not in this video, but uh, all the guys from Ohio Valley Coasters, uh, Chad, Grant, Tim, no, Grant is not here, nope, uh, Andrew's here, and uh, Jacob, Tanner. So uh, it's been a lot of fun hanging out with them. As you can see, I'm hanging out with them right now. No, they're off doing their other rides. So um, that's okay. But we're still meeting up with a lot of local people that have been here. And so uh, it's, been, it's been pretty nice being back here. It's fun being back here because most parks during this time of year are closed. And so I like the Magic Mountain is open 365 days a year so we can come here on a weekend and get our rides in. So this is my first park visit for 2020. And I would say it's a pretty good way to start off the year. Get on a new roller coaster, enjoy some world-class thrill rides. Yeah, it's a good time. Walking back over to this side because we didn't want to leave our group hanging. Let's get some thoughts on the ride because I didn't actually get like Drew's thoughts because I cut him off. I mean, do you want my thoughts? Yeah, go for it. Quick, I, like 20 seconds. Uh, 19, 18, word. 17, 16, 15, 14, 12. Wait. <laughs> All, right. All right, go. Fun. Hey, that's pretty good. Do you agree? Yeah, I would say it's a fun ride. It's, I call it a tweener ride, so it's like a, a step up from a step up ride. Yeah. Big, big Manta, SeaWorld San Diego. Yeah. That's actually like a pretty good comparison. It's just pure fun. Um, I wouldn't say anything about it is really like 
mind blowing because what it does, the whole dueling aspect we've seen before in Twisted Colossus, the difference is this actually duels every time. Yes. And that's the main complaint that Twisted Colossus gets. And so, Engineering yeah. Engineering Marvel, if you think about the, the, the It actually is, yeah. The that they had to make it pace each other the entire time, it's incredible. That, and just look at that structure. Yeah. This structure is so intricate. It's <laughs> insane. Let's get a closer look at this German stuff. German engineering. It, it, yeah, pretty much. So um, over here you have the go-kart track. And so they had to build it completely over and not interrupt that ride experience. So look at this. Do you see this? Oh my gosh. That's crazy. Look at this. There isn't even a support here. Look. It's just an arm extending out. The guys who designed that support structure really should be proud of themselves because that is absolutely incredible. All right, so what should we do next? Uh, I don't know. What do you, what do you want to do? X2? I don't know. X2? Two? X2? Two? Oh, okay. What? I don't know. What do you want to do? You said what do you want to do? X2. 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 We're going to go ride X2. Gold Rusher. Gold Rusher. Hey. Oh, that's hey. That's his best ride, ride in the park. Yeah. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and hop on a few other rides, but there will be a vlog tomorrow from Six Flags Magic Mountain. I just want to give you guys a quick look at West Coast Racers. Also, hey, Dylan. I, I like totally exclude you from the yeah, vlog. One okay. word. What do you think? One word. Awesome. Awesome. There we go. All right, guys. We'll have another vlog tomorrow, so make sure to stay tuned for that. Thank you guys for watching. We'll see you next time.